Hello students, so here is the another question where we have to prepare the amended cash book and then the bank reconciliation statement. Now in this question there is nowhere written that we have to prepare adjusted or amended cash book. But how to understand? When you see the word find out corrected balance as per cash book. So here it is written from the following particulars find out corrected balance as per cash book and thereafter prepare a bank reconciliation statement as on 31st March 2019 of a sole proprietor. So first we have to find out corrected balance which is amended or adjusted cash book and here are the informations given. Bank overdraft as per the cash book 80,000. Now we have learned whenever there is a overdraft in the cash book the opening will start from the buy so here i have made the format cash book amended adjusted bank column only date particulars bank column date particulars bank column debit and credit i have written the date here 31st march 2019 so we'll start with the overdraft opening balance balance bd Next, checks deposited as per bank statement but not entered in cash book. Now what we have to remember while preparing the amended cash book, anything which is recorded in the pass book but not recorded in the not recorded in the cash book okay or anything which is recorded uh, different amount in passbook and the different amount in the cash book so the difference will come in the adjustment okay but if anything is recorded in the cash book but not in the passbook will not come in adjusted or amended cash book okay so here it is written second number checks deposited as per the bank statement but not entered in cash book rupees 3000 so here bank deposit was there but it was not in the cash book we know that the cash book this side is receipt and this side is payment so when we deposit in the bank so we we are receiving money in the bank okay so this was second number we'll write here checks omitted checks omitted to be entered and here we'll write down rupees 3000 next checks recorded for collection but not sent to bank this will not come because we have to correct the bank balance in the cash book okay so here this was not sent to the bank so this will not come so anything which is written down in the cash book but not sent to the bank will not come but if anything which is written in the bank but not recorded in the cash book or wrong record in the cash book will come so this will go in the bank reconciliation number four credit side of the bank column casted short so here this is debit credit so credit side it is short less amount we have on the credit side on the payment side so for how much amount we are less we are short by 1000 so we will write this one down and uh, this is number four okay so we'll write here number four credit side under casted so this is 1000 
next bank charges recorded twice in cash book so this side is the payment so the bank charges were supposed to be 100 but what we did we recorded 100 two times twice so in order to cancel one of the hundred we'll have to we'll have to this was payment so we'll have to reverse it back and we'll have to put on the debit side as receipt of hundred so we will be able to cancel one of the hundred extra hundred that we charged on this side so we already charged hundred and then another two times we charged so one of the hundred we have to cancel so we will take on this side and so this is number five 100 bank charges we'll write on this side number five bank charges 100 next customers check returned as per the bank statement okay so the customers check got returned so the customer this said we receive from the customer so we had received the check but what happened the bank returned it back okay so we'll write it over here the check was returned okay so we'll write here checks returned and that is 4000 okay checks issued but dishonored on technical ground okay this will go in bank reconciliation now both seems to look similar okay but here what is there this has been recorded in the bank statement but now it has been returned so when we had prepared the cash book we had received received the check but now the bank has given us back the check okay so that is from our account like whatever check was been uh, given uh, deposited in the bank so as per the bank statement we got the check returned okay so the side is receipts of the check so the side will be returned and this will go in bank reconciliation statement because the check was issued okay but it was dishonored means it was not accepted by the bank so we have recorded in the cash but not recorded in the bank so this will go in the bank reconciliation statement number eight okay uh, this one is number six number six number eight bills collected by bank directly okay so this side is a receipt so directly the bills are been collected by the bank okay which is not recorded in the cash book so we'll record here on the receipt side bills collection and we'll write here 20,000 okay next this is number eight number nine check received entered twice in cash book okay so whenever we receive we receive on this side so we have already recorded one time and then another time also we have recorded okay so what we have done one time we have recorded and we have recorded twice okay so two times we have recorded so what we'll have to do to cancel one we'll have to take it on the payment side what we have uh, received the check now we'll have to cancel and show it as payment to cancel it okay so 
we'll do the correction now and we'll write it over here number nine checks recorded twice and that is five thousand okay so now we are done with this now we will balance this okay so this side is this side is more okay so this side is coming as 90,000 okay 90,000 90,000 and this side also 90,000 and we will minus 21,300 from 90,000 so that will come to 66,900 okay so here we got our balance CD what we'll do is we will take this balance CD in the bank reconciliation statement now this balance CD will become the balance BD for bank reconciliation statement 66,900 now this we will read as credit balance as per amended cash book so i have made the format here bank reconciliation statement as on 31st march 2019 serial number particulars plus minus item okay so i write here credit balance as per amended cash book okay now we know that the credit balance as per cash book credit means overdraft as per cash book don't forget this if you forget this your whole answer will be wrong debit is favorable credit is overdraft passbook credit is favorable debit is overdraft so this will come on the minus side and how much is the BD 66,900 66,900 okay now we have what we had left we were left with this one number three checks recorded for collection but not sent to bank okay so we are starting uh, this with cash book so check was sent for collection okay but it is not recorded in the passbook which means uh, your cash book is up by how much 10,000 but your passbook is less since we are starting with the cash book we will have to move the cash book down okay so i'll write in the less side less and we'll write down checks recorded in cash book but not sent to bank for collection okay but not sent to bank for collection and right on the minus side 
टेन टेन थाउजेंड ओके देन वी हैव डन दिस वन दिस वन ऑल्सो डन दिस ऑल्सो दिस ऑल्सो एंड दिस वन चेक यू शूड बट दिस ऑन इट ऑन टेक्निकल ग्राउंड सो वी हैव इशूड द चेक ओके सो द चेक वॉज बीन इशूड सो द चेक वॉज द कैश बुक बिकेम लेस बट द चेक इज बिन डिसऑनर्ड ओके सो द पासबुक हैज नॉट हैज डिसऑनर्ड द बैंक इज डिसऑनर्ड एज पर द टेक्निकल ग्राउंड सो योर पासबुक वट विल हैपन नाउ द चेक विच यू हैव इशूड फ्रॉम द कैश बुक विल गो अप नाउ सो विल राइट हियर फ्रॉम द एंड checks issued but not cleared on technical grounds and the amount is 3000 so we'll write 3000 on the plus side okay now we are done we are done with all now we'll balance this side is 3000 and this side is 76900 76900 okay so the balance will come this side so 76900 minus 3000 Is seventy three thousand nine hundred. Okay, so both sides seventy six thousand nine hundred and seventy six thousand nine hundred. Okay. So we'll make it look a little better. we are going to write down is now if you see here the balance is coming this side okay which means the balance is coming this side which means the minus side was more okay so when the minus side is more that means the passbook will be overdraft that is debit Okay. Debit balance as per pass book over draft. Okay, so here what was the funda? You have to see which side is more. So minus side was seventy six thousand nine hundred. That was on the minus side. And on the plus side, we had got three thousand. That was on the plus side. So, what you have to see that we had get we got this much was more on the minus side. So, since the this much amount is more on the minus side, even though we wrote in the plus side to balance it, but this much amount is. more on this side and this much amount is less on this side so 39300 is more on the minus side and so minus in the passbook means overdraft which is debit balance as per passbook okay 
okay so here we made the amended cash book and then with the balance amount that is 66,900 we had the opening of this credit to balance as per amended cash book and then we did uh, according to the question what we, we were asked to do and how did we know that this is debit balance as per passbook because the minus side is more okay so you have to check which side is more don't check this amount check which side is more so you will come to know whether this is debit or credit so we are done with this question please go through this